Hey guys, what's up? It's Nagul again back with another video for you guys. Today I'm gonna be running some benchmarks on the new Asus Zenfone 2 laser. So let's begin. Okay guys, so you know the drill. First of all, into the benchmark to test the CPU performance and overall performance of the device. After that, Nina Mark 2 test to test the GPU performance of the device. And lastly, the multi-test test to see how many fingers altogether this display can support. So let's start with into 2. Now I have Asus Zenfone 2 Laser 1.2 GHz quad core variant which has 5.5 inches of display and 3000 mAh battery. So it's that variant. Now as it's 1.2 quad core, I'm not expecting much score out of it. I'm expecting it to be around 20,000 to 22,000, somewhere in between that. So let's see now. Let me start the test. Here we go. Okay guys, so here is the result, as you can see, it's got 23,711, so that's beyond my expectation because I was expecting it to be around 22,000 max to max, but it scored 23,711, so that's pretty good for a processor which is 1.2 quad core. Anyways, let's go back and... Right now it says not verified because my Wi-Fi is turned off. Let's go back and now let's run the Nina Mark 2 test to test the GPU performance. And here we go. And here is the score guys, as you just saw, 54 FPS, so that's pretty average I would say, not really that bad or not good at all I would say, but it's just average. And if we consider the price range, 10,000 rupees for this phone and we also paid 10,000 rupees for the Lenovo K3 Note, then that phone is just uh, really superior than this. That phone scored amazingly around I think uh, 62 or 63 FPS and the score in N22 was around 44,000 I guess. I don't remember correctly but it was above 40,000 that's what I'm sure about. And in Nina Mark 2 test it was above 60 FPS. So if we look at the price range then this phone is not really that good in terms of hardware because we are paying uh, 10,000 rupees for both of the devices, but this phone is not that good in terms of hardware. But it's not always about the score, I will do test it with the games and everyday performance. So let's wait for the honest review for that, but anyways, now let's go back and now let's turn on the multi-test to see how many fingers altogether this display can support. So here is the multi-test test guys, let's see how many fingers it can support. 1, 2, 3. 4, 5, 6, 7, okay so it's already showing 8 but there are 7 fingers on the screen and now it's 8, 9, 10, okay so that's pretty good, uh, I wasn't expecting that out of this phone, so yeah pretty good that it supports 10 point finger touch, really great. So anyways, that's all for right now guys. This was the benchmark video of the new Asus Zenfone 2 Laser 5.5 inch screen variant. If you like this content, make sure you give it a thumbs up and share with your friends. And as usual, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, anything, put it in the comments down below. I would try my level best to help you out guys. And you can also catch me on my Facebook page. The link of that page will be in the description below. So go and like me there as well. Thank you for watching guys and please please do subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. I will see you next time.